guys, I welcome you back to Target Study YouTube channel with another important video related to one of the most in-demand career field, not only in India, but also in overseas developed countries. No prices for guessing the field. Yes, my dear friends, I'm talking about the field of pharmacy. Thousands of you have seen and liked the videos related to the field of B Pharmacy, M Pharmacy and Pharmacist etc. In line with those, today I'm here with a video on one such entrance exam that can help you get admission in the Masters in Pharmacy course of top pharmacy institutes in India. I suppose by now you must have some clue about the topic I'm going to talk about today. You are very right, I'm talking about widely taken pharmacy entrance exam which is known as Graduate Pharmacy Aptitude Test, better known as GPAT exam. So in this video, I would like to answer some of your basic questions about the exam like exactly what GPAT or Graduate Pharmacy Aptitude Test is. What are the basic eligibility conditions to take GPAT exam? What is the syllabus of GPAT exam? What is the marking scheme for GPAT exam? How to apply for GPAT? What is the fee structure for taking the GPAT? When the exam is normally held? Which are the main test centers of GPAT exam and much more? Let us start with a very basic question that is, what GPAT is all about? Graduate Pharmacy Aptitude Test Abbreviated as GPAT is a national level entrance examination conducted by National Test Agency to facilitate institutes to select suitable pharmacy graduates for admission into the M Pharma program. A few scholarships and other financial assistance in the field of pharmacy are also given on the basis of GPAT scores. The GPAT score is accepted by almost all AICTE or Pharmacy Council of India PCI, affiliated university departments, constituent or affiliated colleges or institutes in India. This three-hour entrance examination in computer-based test mode helps to evaluate the candidate's ability across various segments for admission to the master's program. Now I would like to tell you about the eligibility conditions for taking GPAT exam. Aspiring candidates must hold a bachelor's degree in pharmacy four years after 10 plus 2, including lateral entry students or equivalent from a recognized university. Candidates appearing for the final year of bachelor's degree B Pharmacy, whose result will be declared before commencement of admission for academic year, can also apply for GPAT. Here I would like to mention that the B.Tech Pharmaceutical and Fine Chemical Technology or equivalent candidates are not eligible to apply. Besides, the candidates must be a citizen of India and there is no age restriction for appearing in GPAT. Now I would like to let you know about the syllabus of GPAT exam. The syllabus for the graduate pharmacy admission test covers the entire major as well as subtopics studied at graduation level. The syllabus majority concentrates on the various dimensions of pharmaceutics. Some of the topics from which the questions will be asked in GPAT exam are Physical Chemistry Physical Pharmacy Organic Chemistry Pharmaceutical Chemistry that will include Pharmaceutical Inorganic Chemistry and Medicinal Chemistry Pharmaceutics Pharmacology Pharmacognosy Pharmaceutical Analysis Biochemistry Biotechnology Microbiology Pathophysiology Biopharmaceutics and Pharmacokinetics Clinical Pharmacy and Therapeutics Human Anatomy and Physiology Pharmaceutical Engineering Pharmaceutical Management Pharmaceutical Jurisprudence and Dispensing and Hospital Pharmacy Once you are aware of the syllabus, you would like to know about the pattern of the GPAT exam. GPAT is an online computer-based test of 3 hours duration with 125 objective type questions having a total of 500 marks. The medium of question paper shall be in English only. Each question carry 4 marks. For each correct response, candidate will get 4 marks. For each incorrect response, 1 mark will be deducted from the total score. To answer a question, the candidate need to choose any one option corresponding to the correct option. Any incorrect option marked will be given the minus 1 mark. Unanswered or unattempted will be given no marks. In case a question is dropped or ignored, all candidates will be given 4 marks irrespective of the fact whether the question has been attempted or not attempted by the candidate. Now the most eagerly asked question and that question is how to apply for GPAT exam. The willing and eligible candidates can apply for the GPAT exam online and the first step to apply online is to visit the official website of GPAT that is 
www.ntagpad.nic.in and click on the register button and enter the ask detail along with your email and mobile number and again click on the register button a register id will be sent on your registered email address now log in with the provided registered id and date of birth once you are logged in successfully then fill the application form completely enter all the mandatory details like personal detail academic details etc after this Candidate has to upload the scanned copies of the passport size photograph and running hand signature. Ensure that both files must be in JPG or JPEG format. After the successful upload, you have to pay the application fees. Now I would like to tell you about the examination fee for taking the GPAT entrance exam. You have to pay examination fee as per candidate's category. The GPAT fee for general OBC non creamy layer category Male is rupees two thousand and rupees one thousand for female, whereas the fee for SC, ST, PW candidates is rupees one thousand for both male and female. The GPAT examination fee for transgender is also rupees one thousand. Here, I would like to inform you that this fee varies from year to year, so you are advised to go through the latest notification to know about the prevailing examination fee. Now, what are the test centers of GPAT entrance exam? The GPAT entrance is conducted in almost all the major cities of India. For complete list of test centers and their codes, you can visit targetstudy.com's pharmacy entrance exam section and check the latest list of test centers. At the end, I would like to tell you about some of the most reputed pharmacy institutes accepting GPAT score. Almost all the reputed pharmacy institute of India accepted the score of GPAT exam for providing admission to their master degree program of pharmacy and this includes the names like National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research Mohali Hyderabad Rai Bareilly Kolkata and Ahmedabad Jamia Hamdard New Delhi University Institute of Pharmaceutical Sciences Chandigarh Jadavpur University Kolkata Institute of Chemical Technology Mumbai Department of Pharmaceutics IIT BHU Varanasi Maharaja Sayaji Rao University of Baroda Vadodara Delhi Institute of Pharmaceutical Sciences and Research New Delhi Andhra University Visakhapatnam Government College of Pharmacy Bangalore Bombay College of Pharmacy Mumbai Pune College of Pharmacy Bharti Vidyapeeth University Pune Birla Institute of Technology Misra SRM University Chennai KLE University College of Pharmacy Belgaum Chitkara University Patiala Birla Institute of Technology and Science Pilani and many more Hopefully the details provided here will be helpful for candidates who are interested in taking the graduate pharmacy aptitude test If you still have any further queries you may let us know in the comment section We'll try our best to provide the right information to you soon. If you like this video, please hit the like button. For regular notification, please subscribe Target Study YouTube channel. Till then, stay healthy and safe. Good luck.